my beautiful people and welcome to another vlog. Uh, I don't want to say sorry for the absence because hopefully if you've seen the last video, if you haven't, go watch it, then that'll explain my um, absence. But I thought I'd just do a little vlog because the next couple of days are really exciting. So today as I'm filming this, it is the 10th of June, which means it's Mama Bear's birthday. So um, we haven't done presents in such yet, but I can show you some of our presents later. But the dogs are playing down the stairs. But um, the theme of this weekend coming up is pink. Um, I'm just about, I've just finished my lunch, I'm just about to go to... Well, it's the hairdressers, but I'm not getting my hair done. Uh, to get my nails done, and I'm gonna go for um, two different types of pink. I would love in an ideal world to get my pinky a darker pink, and then a kind of silhouette love heart in a baby pink. But the the lady who does my nails, she doesn't. She's not as like adventurous as that. I don't want to say she's not good because she is good. Of course she is, but she doesn't. Um, do that kind of thing so um, yeah but nonetheless it'll be really really good and um, the the pink will continue for the weekend I'm not gonna film when I'm getting my nails done just because uh, she's not too keen in the camera which is totally understandable but I, I'm also getting something done on Friday ho ho I'm getting my hair done so that thing that I've been wanting to get done for months and months and months I'm finally getting done I'm so excited unbelievably excited I actually bought the dye myself um so yeah I, that's a, a little sneak peek of a what's to come but I'll probably film a little bit uh, when I'm getting my hair done because Nikki my hairdresser does not mind at all so yeah Let's carry on with the day. Hey guys, so wanted to tell you, little parsnips got a cold, so we have to keep her like calm and relaxed just now because anytime she gets excited, she starts coughing. And I'm gonna show you what I mean because I've got treats sitting in my, in my lap, and I know the minute I say to her, you know, come and get a sweetie. She'll uh, get excited and uh, you'll hear what I mean. So, uh, yeah, here we go. They're not up the stairs yet, so I'll go in the hall. So, start, parsnip, sweetie! Come get a sweetie! One. It's parsnip. Stark, where's Parsnip? Parsnip, come get a sweetie! Here she comes. You've got a cold, don't you? <laughs> Can you hear her when she's like sniffing? She's a bit like wheezy. Come on, are you gonna show the people the noise you make when you get excited? You want a sweetie? She might do it after, or she might not do it at all. Sit. There you go. Right, Stark. I don't know if you guys are in frame. There you go. Shut this box. Oh. Chew it, Parsnip. That's a good girl. He's my wee girl who's got a gold. Don't you? You've got a gold. Don't you? Don't you? You've got a cold. Oh, you can kind of hear it. She's like a little bit wheezy, but she's not doing her full coffin fit. Aren't you not? Right, I'll give you one more, just a wee baby one though. Because there is wee baby training treats in here, like wee chocolate drops. There's two, because they're tiny. Yum yum, give you two, Stark. There you go, there you go. We've got one dog that can't see and one dog that's got a cold. Yum yum. 
but um, it's a good thing though she's not having a coffin fit when I'm giving her her sweet. She is getting much better, aren't you? She tends to do it a lot when she thinks she's going out a walk and um, when people are leaving or, or coming back in the house. But yeah, you're getting better. We've been feeding her wet food as well. Yee. So these are my nails. Are they not the most kawaii thing you've ever seen in your life? So, here we go, if memory serves me right. They're all pink. So, the pinky is a baby pink with a fuchsia pink love heart. Then the, the ring finger is a, a baby pink with, it's kind of like, is it like, what kind of, it's pink glitter but what kind of pink is it? Is it like... A no, that's not glitter, that one. What's that one? That's just your plain pink. Oh, so that's the ba plain baby pink with no glitter. Uh-huh. Right, so that's... I would say it was baby pink. I would say it was a, 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 a deeper pink. Oh, so that's the fuchsia pink. Yes. Right. So, round finger is a fuchsia pink. So yes. think of Barbie pink, but a little bit darker. Mm -hmm. Then the middle finger's baby pink with the pink glitter. Yes. Then the pointing finger is, again, baby pink with the pink glitter. Yes. And then the thumb wait, is... Wait, 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 is it? Yeah. Yeah. The thumb is the opposite from the pinky. So it is a fuchsia pink background with a baby pink love heart. Yep. See, it's so cute. I love them so much. And Ashley done such a great job and she even said these are her favourite nails she's done on mine so far. They are very pink delicious. They're just, mm -hmm. yeah, they're, they're so cute. So it's actually National Iced Tea Day today and I had a I've been doing a lot of like cold brew and stuff like that and I decided oh I'm gonna do something wild so I made a cold brew this morning it's milk and a chocolate mint tea bag so it's only been cold brewing for about six hours and I'm gonna have it for my tea tonight but I was gonna have like a quick little drink just now just just to see what, how it's coming along so um, let's see Make sure I'm in frame because it wouldn't be good if I wasn't and you couldn't see my reaction. Here we go. That's quite nice. It definitely is. It's like a minty chocolatey milk. It's quite, it's quite subtle. It's lovely. No, give that a few more hours and that'll be really nice. Hello my lovelies, it is now Friday. Excuse the braggled hair, but that's going to go and get fixed. So I'm just going down to the hairdresser right now. Literally I was sitting on the stairs putting my shoes on and I'm like, I haven't even started the day for the vlog. And mum's like, do you do it at the hairdressers? And I'm like, oh can you imagine that? Uh, the hair, the hairdresser Caroline sat next to me and I just whip out my camera like, hey guys, I'm at the hairdressers. And, most people that, that don't do vlogging or don't know YouTube would be like, what? <laughs> but um, yeah, I've got my pink sunglasses on, don't know if you can see them on the top of my head. And I'm also wearing, oh my wardrobe's open. I'm also wearing my pink skinny jeans. And if you go all the way down to the bottom, my baby pink Converse in preparation for what's to come. My dyes are in my bag, so let's grab my bag, grab my cane, and let's go. Okay, my roots have been re -blonded. Yes, we put bleach on them. Oh, are you right there? I'm right here. <laughs> I'm right beside you. And uh, so what, what are we doing next, Matthew? Okay. So, okay, I'll get the stuff. Uh -huh. So we're gonna put this, oh, here are, there we go this colour on uh, all over Rachel's hair. What colour is it? It is like really bright pink, a kind of fuchsia colour. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to use the Hyper Coral, which I've mixed with conditioner and we're going to do like kind of slices of colour through the hair. So this should be quite fun to do. Yeah. So I'll just start the now then. Oh, pink and exciting! Yay! <laughs> Yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, you're just filming at the side? I'm just filming, yeah. Oh. <laughs> just so my blind people know as well. So this is Rachel's finished hair. It's all done. And it's like we went like a little bit darker so that it lasts longer. So it's like a fuchsia pink and then a kind of like peachy pink coral. Uh, what is it? You call them slices? Yes, slices. So you can kind of see it all kind of through here. It's very like My Little Pony vibe. My Little it? Pony vibe. That's what it's sure. given me. Oh yeah, definitely. This is the finished product. Give us a wave, Rachel. In the mirror. Yay. In the mirror. It's so cute. <laughs> Hello, my pretties. It's much later now. It's eight o'clock at night. All I did after I got my hair done is Mum and I nipped into Marks and Spencers to get dinner. I've just ate. I got a cheese pretzel. I've just ate about half of it. Oh, it's so good. I've never had the cheese ones before and mum picked it up and she was like, oh yeah, they have pretzels. And then more in the checkout, she was like, it's, I've just noticed it's a cheese one, is that okay? And I'm like, yeah, like, cheese is amazing. So I'm just ate some of that there. Um, but yeah, my boyfriend called me um, when I came back and he's like, oh, you know, how are you? What are you up to? You know, thinking nothing of it because we're always in regular contact. And then... Um, my dad went out to Tesco to pick up some shopping, so I was in my room just pottering around. And I heard someone come through the front door, just assumed it was dad, because he was the only one that left. Now usually when dad goes to Tesco, he goes straight into the kitchen to, you know, put the shopping down. But the person came through the front door and went straight up the stairs, and I was like, hmm, that's strange. Furthermore, the person came straight into my room, and I was like, What's he wanting? What, what have I done? You know, thinking, oh, she doesn't, this is very out of character. And then lo and behold, my boyfriend came right up to me, tackled me and hugged me and said, hello. I was so confused. So um, he popped in to say hello to me because he just um, finished with somebody and he had three hours until his next, like, shift started. So he was like, ah, I didn't want to go home. So I thought I'd come and see you since I was passing this way. So that was lovely. So, um... Yeah, it's pretty much all I've done. Um, I'm going to go for a bath and do um, a face mask because I have got pink dye all over my forehead. And um, we're going out tomorrow for um, Mum's birthday lunch. So I'll take you along with us because I have a whole outfit planned that matches my hair, my nails. So that'll be really exciting. But yeah, I do love my hair. Uh, like I said earlier, it's darker than I originally wanted it. Originally I wanted it to be kind of a like Barbie pink but maybe a shade lighter and then with the baby pink uh, coral flashes. But we had to make the flashes thicker otherwise they wouldn't be noticed. So the coral's not baby pink, it's more of an like a peachy pink. And I think the pink is more of a kind of like fuchsia magenta pink. But Nikki says it's better to go darker because as I wash it, it will lighten up. So it eventually will be that colour. But if I was to originally go like baby pink and Barbie pink, it wouldn't last as long. So I totally get that logic. And the longer I have it, the better I am. So yeah, I feel very My Little Pony-like. And then tomorrow, oh, uh, I'll just be in my element with my outfit. But yeah, I just wanted to round up this day with my... Um, non-sequential rabble. I don't even know if that sentence I just said was even coherent. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow for pancakes! Hello, it's the next day and we're in Primark and I wasn't going to film but then I thought that would make me a, a terrible vlogger. But um, we're looking at the cardigans right now because I... What are you doing mum? Around about, make sure you're in free. Oh, right. Um, we're looking at the cardigans right now because I quite fancy a wee cardigan. And you were saying there was a pink one. That's a pink one, and it's got a kind of square rounded neck. I think I know what you mean when you say that. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice one. It's ribbed. Oh, I like a ribbed. Mm -hmm. Wait, can I feel it? Where is yes, it? Yes, here. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's nice. That's, is it what kind of pink is it? Is it like a baby pink or is it a candy flamingo mm. pink? I'm just saying pink names now. Mm, no, it's not pink like your hair, it's a, a lighter, I would say a lighter peachy pink. 
Ah, okay, cool. Yeah, I can vibe with that. I can vibe with that. That's quite cute. Is it a long one or a short one? Um, probably, it's not short, but it's not long. So Does it go to like your yeah, waist? Probably, yeah. Ah, okay, cool. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. That or longer or something like that. Yeah. So, what other colours do we have? I don't think there's that many. It's the most exciting. Give me your arm. Oh, we'll have to move. Wait, is it recording? Yes, it is. Oh, it's recording. Yes. Hello. We are in Stack and Style oh, yeah, yeah. and we've just ordered. I've got a wee, that's a lot, that's a lot, a wee cheeky that. Earl Grey. And if it's in frame. Are you having a nice time so far, Mum? Yes, I am. We don't get out very often, so no, this is a treat. Wait, wait. What kind of view? We're next to the window. What kind of view do we have? View of Glasgow. Of a bus. Oh. Easter House. <laughs> Oh, that's very Glasgow, isn't it? It is indeed. You get Wagamamas across the road. I haven't been to Wagamamas in ages. <laughs> and John says he'd be more than happy to to go uh -huh. uh, because you know John's a little bit fussy with food, but he said he'd be more than happy to try it. So I need to take him up on that one of these days. He's had to wait the He's waiting. It's because he had a gigantic cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. And look who else is here. Hello. I don't know if you're in frame. Can you see yourself? Uh, if I move it down a little bit, yeah. Move it down. <laughs> there you go. There you go. It's my brother. <laughs> How are you? Sorry, I'm just excited because you've never been in one of my videos before. Yeah, I probably have in the background. Oh. In the background, yeah. never speak. Yeah. Are you looking forward to your pancakes? I am. It's going to be delightful. Yeah. It's going to be delightful. Absolutely amazing. Yeah. <laughs> So this is mine. I've got a double buckwheat pancake with bananas, blueberries, and biscuit. Mum has got. Are you in frame? Okay, get forward. Down, down. Mum, there. There. Uh -huh. Mum has got a, a double stack buttermilk with a grilled peaches, blueberries. Did you get cream? No, I get ice cream. Ice cream and vanilla ice cream. Yes. And then I'll show you David's because David's is exactly the same as uh, Dad's. But he's got a single and Dad's got a double and it's smoked salmon and avocado. So I'm going to eat it. Oh. oh. We're just having a wee walk around Glasgow and it's dead sad. Because we're looking for somewhere to have drinks. But everywhere is shut. Like... This wee place here with the girl in the corner in Wellington Street is shut. And then the bar down there, what was it called? The Woods? The Woods and yeah. you said you've been to it and it's always dead busy. Yep. And it's shut. It's just dead sad, like, because you think places are getting back to normal, but unless you book, because we tried to go into... This is the third place it's shut. Yeah, we tried, what was it, Gen 71? Yeah. And we couldn't get in, because obviously if you, don't, if you don't book, you're humped. And it's just... I mean, it's, I was saying that to Mum and David and Dad, it's lovely being out again and it almost feels as if I'm on holiday because it's been so long since I've been out and it's lovely. But when you come here, it is quieter and it's just, it's, it's strange. It's very strange. Hello my pretties. It's Wednesday now and I thought I'd hop on to wrap up the vlog. Because I think the last time I vlogged, it might have been Sunday, I can't remember. I was going to vlog a little bit more on Sunday because uh, my boyfriend and I were going to be doing something but change of plan and I just kept saying to myself oh I need to end my vlog I need to end my vlog and I never did so I'm ending it now um, this vlog will probably maybe go up in the same day we'll see we'll see either today or tomorrow uh, but yeah, after the last time I vlogged, I haven't really been doing much else. Um, my mum's been like decluttering a lot, so I've been doing little bits here and there. Like I got rid of a couple of tops. Um, my Cinderella picture. So hopefully I'm pointing at it right over there. If you can see like a big green wall, I used to have a Cinderella canvas. I now have hopefully I'm getting it in frame, um, a little sailing boat kind of picture. So it's a painting and it's a little boat in a harbour. Um, I'm going to go up closer to it and show you guys. I've got a cup of tea on the floor. I know, why does a blind person leave cups of tea on the floor? Um, so hopefully if you couldn't see it then you can see it now. Uh, but my grandpa painted that and I just, I've not grown out of Disney, 
but with some things I have, I'm not crazy Disney like I used to be and I just, this kind of holds more sentimental value to me. Plus, it's kind of sea themed and I've always loved the sea. And, um, oh, I'm also wearing, if you couldn't see, my new pink cardigan I got when I was uh, in Primark. First time I've been in Primark in goodness knows how long. But yeah, um, most of the mugs I have I'm giving to charity, but I just wanted to hold one back to to see if I could sell it. Uh, I'm trying to sell it in Facebook Marketplace. I've never had much luck in Facebook Marketplace before, so I'm trying it again. So it is... Where is it? It's this mug up here. Hopefully it's in frame. It's my Art of Animation Stitch Mug Disney Store. And it's um, a rare find now because Disney Store always change their mugs every season and I got this mug a couple of years ago so this mug like won't exist anymore. They had a few Art of Animation mugs. I really do hope it's in frame. Um, so yeah, I'm selling it in a Facebook marketplace for £6 and I'm like advertising it here on my channel now because you know, I get excited about it. Like, I'd really like to be able to sell something. I've never uh, done it. I've never had much luck. But because Mum's cleaning out a lot of things as well, I have to show you some. I got these mugs from the Disney store ages ago, so I'll pull this one down. This is my Snow White one. Um, hmm, I'll put it down here and see if this is any better from this viewpoint. Hopefully it is. Um, so this is my Snow White mug. So I've got a Snow White one, a Rapunzel one, a Cinderella one, an Aurora one, and oh, I have five. Was that five? I have another one, but they're all Disney princesses. So they're all kind of inspired from their outfit. So I can't exactly remember what the Snow White one looks like, but it will be her outfit. So I think the cup is mainly red with the navy blue. It's got a, a Diamante um, apple on it. The only other mug that has a Diamante little accent is the Cinderella one. She has a, a Diamante shoe. And then the handle, I love the handle is uh, supposed to be like Snow White's hair so it's like all black and textured and I think from memory when I could see there was like a little red bow on it as well this is my boyfriend's favourite one and then I'm actually drinking out of one right now which is on the floor oh. um, where, where are you Rapunzel? here she is, I'm drinking out of her right now again hopefully you can see it okay so this is the Rapunzel one this is mmm my second favourite. So again, the handle. Oh, the handle is a uh, Rapunzel's braid. So pretty. Definitely making sure it's in frame. I mean, look at the detail. And then the cup itself is a uh, Rapunzel's corset. So in the film, she wears like a, a kind of pinky purple. It's more purple, but it is pinky purple corset. So you can actually... I can't see it, but if you were blind or visually impaired, you can feel the details on it. And they're like really good sized mugs. So, I had never used these mugs for drinking out of. They were always display mugs, because when I first got them, I wanted them to drink out of. And my mum was like, oh no, they're too decorative. But because we were cleaning out the cupboard, I did say to mum, I'm like, I cannot part with these. These are like absolutely gorgeous mugs. I say they're from Disneyland Paris. I've never been to Disneyland Paris before. I got them in the Disney store but they were from Disneyland Paris and um, I said to mum do you think it'd be okay to drink out of them? So I spent my day yesterday cleaning them all and they are my babies. They're like my pride and joy. I, I could never get rid of them. So yeah that's basically all I've been doing for the past few days is just like slowly uh, taking things to charity and seeing if I can sell wee bits here and there and I don't really have anything planned for this weekend either it's, it's went all quiet again but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog I certainly did filming it I love filming vlogs comment down below something interesting you did at the weekend or you're going to be doing oh and another fun one comment down below your favourite vegetable.
<laughs> to make sure that you've watched right to the end. But I love you guys and I'll talk to you in another video at some point. Bye!